All right, guys. So let's see what is behind this door. As I use the key to open it. <clears throat> the castle gate key, of course. Oh, it's a castle. to wonder when you might notice us. Who are you? Me llamo Ramon Salazar, the eighth castellan of this magnificent architecture. I have been honored with the prodigious power from the great Lord Sadler. I've been expecting you, my brethren. No thanks, bro. My, my. We've got a feisty one. If you care for your own well-being, I suggest you surrender yourself and simply become our hostage. Or, Mr. Scott, you can give us the girl because you're not worth a penny, I'm afraid. You can die. I'm never turning into one of them. Never. Got that right. We'll find a cure. I love how sure Leon is about everything. Alright, so right now I'm just looking around, seeing if there's anything to loot. And I recall a spinel. Oh, after this wall magically rises from the floor. Which makes no fucking sense, but there's a spinel way up there. I don't know if it's a spinel or something else, like a velvet blue or something. But it's treasure nonetheless. Ooh, it's even better. It's a green gem, and that goes in something. I forget what. It won't budge. It must be locked from the other side. Yes, it is. And then you check this little thing here, and you have to find pieces to a missing puzzle thing. I mean, it's not a puzzle, but uh, you have to find pieces to this mythical beast. I believe that was a chimera, if I am not mistaken. And then you go through the only other door available, and you just start going. And uh, right here is kind of a funny part. <clears throat> After I check, I think I do some looting and uh, get that shit done with, you know what I mean? Do you? Do you know what I mean? Do you know what looting is? <clears throat> yeah, check behind those paintings. You can't always, but a good amount of time. Um, you can look back behind paintings and see gold or whatever, or pesetas. And you have to go this way to get a key, and you realize, hey, there is fire blocking the way. Um, let's read this together. Capture Lewis Sarah. I have confirmation that Sarah has created the cast, has entered the castle. Sorry, I can't read this very well. Why he would return during his escape leaves me to question his motives, but we must seize blah blah blah. I don't even know. I'm scrolling too fast. <clears throat> so basically, it's just saying that. Uh, they need to. They really need to get Sarah, but they're still looking for the other two Americans, which is me and Ashley. It, but uh, Sarah took the sample and the vaccine, so they need to get that shit back, yo. And I don't feel like reading the whole thing, but basically, if you want to, you can go back and uh, pause it. <clears throat> but I don't feel like reading it. But that's basically the gist of it. They really need to get Sarah because he took vaccines to the virus, and he took a sample. So fuck, man. That guy just jacked their shit, yo. Um, and right here on this painting, there is a key. The prison door key or some shit like that. I'm trying to read on this really small screen. Just mix my herbs. You know how I do. And I don't know why I'm still in my menu. I need to really hurry the fuck up. I don't know what I'm doing right here. There we go. Now comes the fun part. Wait. Alright, so I tell Ashley to wait because that's kind of necessary at this, this uh, moment in time. A prison, perhaps? 
I don't even know why it wastes your time telling you what this is a door to. And how is the door open like that? It opens up to the top. I, what kind of mechanisms are they using in this castle? Yeah, they keep some dude down here chained up by a switch that, uh, apparently, I don't know, I don't know why he's chained up. I guess to throw you off your game. Oh shit, run. So this guy, he's blind, but I guess he can hear you really well, and I even get the sense that he can smell you because, um, <clears throat> I don't know, sometimes I just stand still and he just walks right to me. So right now I whip out my sniper because it's uh, one of my more powerful g Oh fuck! I had a burp there, hold on. That hurt. I just repressed a burp and it fucking pains me now. Okay. Mm. Fuck. So the sniper is a good weapon to use against this guy because you can keep your distance. And right now I'm actually walking too fast. He can hear that shit. And uh, yeah I pay for it. I need to, you seriously need to walk as slow as you possibly can and this guy will not hear you. But, I was being foolish and I was walking midway, um, you know what I mean, I was walking like, not as slow as I could, but, you know, I could have walked faster, but I should have walked slower because he can still hear my footsteps apparently, and uh, I just, this part, I just could not find <coughs> any, any breathing room. He was chasing me so hard, and there goes my head. And uh, I thought that was kind of bullshit, because he, he he got there so fast, and he faked me out hardcore, because I thought he was going around the other way. And then I saw he was coming to my left, and I tried to hurry up and run, but he just he had such a reach with those claws, he just straight up destroyed me. And uh, I'm not going to lie to you guys, I'm not going to cut out any of my deaths, I'm just going to go with it. So let's go with attempt number two. Pretty sure I get him on the second try. Because uh, I decided to um, walk even slower in this one. I think I start walking really, really slow. It's uh, this this moment though. It just get it really gets to you. It's like. Holy shit, I can't see him because I'm trying to walk away from him really, really fucking slow. And I don't know if he's right behind me or not. And it's just like, so. this is one of the most intense parts of the entire game, is when you're fighting one of these guys. And it's uh, you have to walk really slow, and you have to have your back turned to him, and you know he's faster than you. And uh, he can just swing those claws at any moment. So right here, I'm just trying to walk really slow. <laughs> And I see him swinging wildly. So I try to give him a shot on him and I, I managed to do that. And I, I don't remember what I'm doing here. I think I'm just waiting. Trying to move really, uh, really quietly but a little bit at a time so that I can still see. You know, I, I want to keep a distance but I want to be able to turn quickly and see where he's coming from. I'm trying to keep that pillar in between us but I have to move in a second because I'm having no luck. Or maybe I shoot the bell. If I remember correctly, I might shoot the bell. Cause I get tired of waiting. There we go. And uh, he gets his hand stuck, and I think it's getting close to me finally beating this guy. This fucking monster of a man. <clears throat> Once again, that pillar is straight up cock blocking my sniper. If I was smart I'd just shoot the bell over there. But I, I don't want to move because I just got my head chopped off. So I'm just waiting. Being uh being a patient little uh little fella. And I failed. So I need to walk really slow. I don't know why I haven't shot that bell yet. I guess I was saving it for a dire situation. There we go, got him. And he drops a nice 15,000.
and you hit the switch and the the horses stop breathing fire I don't <laughs> I don't know why they chose horses look at Follow that me. horse <clears throat> right here I try to be f fucking fancy and pull off a slick move and I completely fail because he faked me out he just started sprinting at me like a douchebag I, I almost I, I felt like that several times trying to set traps for people And out pops the Plogus. God, look how many times I'm shooting this thing. There we go. Finally. Alright, now I'm starting to move on with my next part. Oh, there's still guys. Dynamite. Shit. Back up, stupid. I think right here I'm like, fuck that. I'm getting her the fuck out of here. Wait. Yeah, I just run way back here until Ashley to wait, and then I just charge in here and take take care of business pretty much. Follow me. Right here, I think there's one guy left. But I just can't remember. Yep, there was. And he's gonna throw dynamite. And he's gonna fail because I shoot the dynamite out of the fucking air somehow. I don't know how I do it. But Leon's a beast, so... Oh, there's another. Another foolish enough to take Leon... On. Leon on. Take on Leon. Alright, so it looks like this is going to be the end of this one. So, uh, yeah. Thanks for watching, guys. Once again, and have an excellent day.